What a Shaolin song, I love it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's present the blue quarter. Age 16, the weight 60 kilograms, height 1.75 meters, reach 1.77 meters. Having a personal record, two fights, one win, and one loss. He's fighting for close 14 gladiators. From Romania, for best of them, let's give it up for Lipa Alexandro. And now, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the red corner. Age of 18, weight 55 kilograms, height 1.60 meters, reach 1.62 meters. Having a personal record, five fights, four wins and four losses. He's fighting for blue sporting impact, specialized in kickboxing and karate. Ladies and gentlemen, for Bucharest, Romania, let's give it up for Roman! And I'm expecting to see a lot of work from these guys. They're only 60 and 55 kilograms. And when you get to lower weight categories, you tend to see a lot more work in the rounds. It's going to be a busier fight than the first one. As I said, I've seen Robert Long before. Very sharp, very technical. Moves very well. Very light on his feet. But he is going to have to get in close to his opponent, Victor, tonight. If he's going to do any lasting damage, Alexander Victor, clearly the bigger of the two men, both in weight and height. So Robert Long is going to have to fight his way in and get inside. That kick just missing. Oh, that left hand. It's the second time that left hand caught him. Very good punch, dazed his opponent. Referee stopping to give a standing eight. Let's see if Robert Long can capitalize on the success he's had so far. And it's that big left hand from the southpaw that caught Victor Alexandru. Let's see if Robert can line that up once again. Very good counter. Obviously doing the slip. Our referee jumps in. And then another punch stops his opponent. Oh, and here we go. It's a standing eight. They are contesting it. But it was a standing eight count. It was a very good punch that landed. Very clean. And he did go down. Robert Long just needs a, one more standing eight, one more stoppage of any kind, and that is going to be a first round knockout, but he was caught with a low blow there. I saw the shin, it did land. Sadly, it's one of those inevitabilities about kickboxing. This does happen. It's happened to me many times throughout my career, but uh, everything, downstairs still works perfectly fine ladies so don't worry about that but yeah this does happen it's a shame lots of success from Robert earlier on in the first round he could have won the fight but now I think it's going to go into the second because of the low blow Another big left hand. Lots of good body kicks. <laughs> A little bit of showboating there. Showboating's only cool if you win though, Robert, so keep it up, keep the pressure on. Nice spinning back kick. Now, he's claiming low blow. I'm not sure it was. Sure it was. If you're hitting the body and you need time to rest, you pretend you were hit with a low blow. Here we go, Robert is laying the pressure back 
back on. the ring. Very good footwork. We uh, expect a man of his size on his great physical condition moves on his feet very well. He keeps throwing and hitting nothing but thin air. Very good spinning heel kick. Very good, landed directly on the liver. That was not a low blow. That knocked the wind out of Victor Alexandru, and that might be the end of the fight. And that is it. Another victory to Robert Wu Hua Long.